This is an ODMC and it can jam Wi-Fi. This node MCU performs a simple deauthentication attack to the selected Wi-Fi. Perfect. Perfect. It will also generate many clones of the targeted Wi-Fi to confuse the victim. Hello guys, this is Psycraft here. So in today's video, we are going to make a deauthor, not a jammer. A deauthor and a jammer are completely different things. As you can see, the difference between a deauthor and a jammer. A deauthor is specifically designed to target Wi-Fi networks and disconnect devices from them. But a jammer is a device or software that generates strong radio signals to interfere with various wireless networks. So to make a deauthor using NodeMCU, you have to download a bin file from this GitHub repo. The link of this GitHub repo is in the description. So to download this win file, go to releases and here are different version of the win file. But I would like to download this version. Now you have to download a flasher tool to flash the bin file to the node MC. So here you can see a download option to download the flasher tool. So now the flasher tool is downloaded. So go to downloads. So now extract this zip file and then open the extracted folder and install the exe file. So here you can see a window, select chip type ESP8266. And in the work mode, select develop. Just click on OK. Now you can see a window will open. From this, we can flash the bin file to the node MCU. Before we flash, first connect the node MCU to the computer. Now select the three dot button and select the bin file that we had downloaded. Here you will need to provide the address for this. So type 0 cross 0 0 0 0 0 that is 50. So finally select a COM port. In my case it is COM3 and click on start. So this takes some time to flash the bin file. After the flashing is completed then on your computer look for the Wi-Fi and the name will appear as PWNAD. Just connect it and the password is dauthor. D E A U T H E R D author. Once the computer is connected to this Wi Fi network, then go to the browser and type 192.168.4.1. Then the page is open. Here you can see your nearby Wi Fi. So from here, you have to select your Wi Fi. And then go to the attack section. And finally, start at the authentication attack. Now you can see my phone is not unable to connect to the Wi Fi. So it is connecting, disconnecting, connecting, disconnecting. So this process will continue until you stop the attack now we have a second option called beacon so to use this attack go to ssid now here enter the name of the wi-fi that you have selected so enter the number of wi-fi's you want to generate so 
I'm generating 50 number of IFRS. And now you have to click on add. So you can see 50 number of IFRS is added. So now we can start the beacon attack. So again go to attack and start. So here you can see there are many similar WIFIs. So in this case the victim will confuse which is the real ones. If you like this video then subscribe our channel, it's free guys.